All right, I want to talk about another option that I utilize for bending tubing, both in steel, titanium, and aluminum. Uh, this is a self-contained hydraulic bender. It's powered using the same Interpack press power unit uh, that I use for the JD2 squared bender as well. However, this one is a little bit different. Uh, in speaking with fully encapsulating the tubing, you can see that I have different dies made up to encase the tube. Uh, there are two that it rests on. Uh, with individual pivots and then a third that actually has the curved bent shape milled into it that acts as the arbor press so that the power unit above can have its stroke pressed down on the center allowing the two bottom cradles uh, to move in. The pin with the blue tape on it that you see is a stop and that allows me to control uh, just how much of a bend I want. In this case we're bending love handle centers so this is a fixed stop uh, that gives me the correct position uh, for the final bent pieces, which you see right here. So what I thought I'd do is uh, show you how this can be utilized. Um, basically, I have a power unit that I use uh, to step on, and we're going to apply some pressure. And here we go. There are bends made. Now we're going to back off the pressure. And that gives us one half of our love handle bend. You can see it's wrinkle free, nice and round, good shape. Power unit uses different sized dies so I can do everything from chain stays to seat stays uh, to even some of the larger uh, down tubes if I choose to, to have a bend that's either gentle or a little more acute. Just another option in the arsenal for bending bicycle tubing. Thanks.